Howdy y'all. Thank you for joining us today for this Kickstarter I just got in. Dog Park. And this is the Collector's Edition. And I also got the All In. Before we get right to that, I'll show some of the just little bits and stuff that came in. It's not really anything. I don't. I think there's some of it's about gameplay. Nah, a little bit of it. Not much of it. Like, this is just some bookmarks is all it is. Uh, it looks like they're the same on both sides. But just let you know the difference. Toy dogs, terrier dogs, pastoral, hound, and gun dog. Because I'm assuming those are just bookmarks. That's the way I look at them. And then there was this thing, which I'm not sure how I feel about it. Oh, this is just a, I just realized what this is. It's a dust cover. I thought it was like some type of art thing. Yeah, I didn't realize that at first. I thought this was like some type of art thing. I was like, I don't know what to do with this. But this is actually, looks like a dust cover or dust sleeve, however you want to look at it, for the game. Which will go around it like such. But cool. Of course, it won't say dog part there, but I think if you know it, you know what it is. All right. And then the last thing that came in here, we can see it's got like some wooden bits and some stickers. Ooh, try to open this without tearing up the stickers too much. There we go. So we got what looks like another bookmark here. A uh, postcard. It's got a few little dings that did sit it, but if you actually used it for mailing, and like it's going not going to get dinged and dented up anyways. Another postcard, postcard, and a postcard. Some stickers, and then. Some wooden bits, I'm assuming, for the players. All right, so let's get to what you actually came here to see is the game. I just want to show you everything that came with the all-in. You can see here, this is a game for one to four players uh, for ages 10 plus and takes about 40 to 80 minutes to play. You can see here, you're going to be going to the dog park and doing things, of course. Shows you all the components here, right there. It even shows you what's in the collector's edition over here. So that if you want to know the differences, so if you're looking to see what the retail and collector's edition are, and we'll see if there's a sheet or something, or if I can notice or find point that stuff out. Looks like it's expansion packs and then kennel boards. And then wooden components, which should be in here. All right, we'll see as we open this. All right, does have a nice, I always forget what that's called, bossing there. You can see of the dogs to the artwork. All right, so we got the rule book here. Not the fancy here, just uh, shows the components. Setup, player setup, game essentials that you need to know. And then we get to the gameplay. And we got one, two, three, four. Looks like about six pages, maybe seven. Yep, because five is really the final scoring. Then we get to the solo rules. And then we get to the different variants. And then we have an index for the cards, I'm assuming. And then frequently asked questions. And it shows here the collector's edition it's letting you know what's different it's showing you the four kennels will be different it's showing you the upgraded reputation markers which we saw over here already i think maybe not maybe these are just different ones because these are not the same ones they're showing there yeah these are not the same ones they're showing there so then we got sticks balls treats and toy tokens and then it shows 
the two expansions. So that's what comes with the collector's edition. All right, we got some wood and stuff here, or some cardboard, I should say. And I'm gonna pull, I'm gonna pull these out. I, I know I'm showing them through the bag, but I'll pull them out and get a closer look at them. But we got here what looks like some dials that are gonna be made, along with some dog leashes. The other part of the dials, which I'll probably let someone else do because I hate making those dials. All right, we have a board here. Let me see if I can zoom out to show the full board. All right, so you can see the full board there where it has starting here and going around the outside for the victory points, I'm assuming. And then we have breed expert area. And from what I understand, this is the walk you're gonna take the dogs upon and you can choose which path you wanna go on. And if I remember right, you're gonna be doing multiple days, I think, but maybe four days, rounds, whatever you wanna call them, but cool. All right, and these are the upgraded collectors, which I kind of got a dinged one up here, it looks like. It's kind of dented in. But I'm not sure what the original was supposed to come with, but this, this is what well, I understand, the kennel. Maybe it's you can have up to eight dogs, so they're showing the eight dogs in the player colors. Looks like red, yellow, green, and I'm not sure. Red, green, little green. I mean, here it's showing red, yellow, green, purple. So probably one of these were purple. Yeah, that's probably purple and that's probably red. Yeah, I see it now. Yep. Or actually the other one, I see it. Yeah, either way. All right. We got some score sheets here. Looks like they are double-sided. And looks same on both sides. We have some dog trays, which I'll fill those up and show at the end of the video. Let's go ahead and look at these. So these are the ones from the base game. You could see them. Looks like these are the ones that were in the baggie. I'm assuming they're just giving you an alternate look for each of them. And I'll show them as pairs here. So you can just see the comparisons. I'm not gonna lie. I love dogs. And I've been switching to red because that's the color no one else wants to play, typically. But if I was choosing out of these, yeah, I think I'd want to play the yellow or the green. Anyways, all right. Then it looks like we got some extra little stuff here. This just looks like probably the first player marker, I'm assuming. Looks like a little doghouse. Looks like this is where the dials will go once they're done. We got a little birdie here. Which looks like it goes right there. And then we have a dice. It is a wooden dice. So it's not a normal six side as far as like a D6. I think the most I see is the four. But... Do I have a dice here to go there? Oh, no. Just gonna put it there. All right. What do we got down in here? Not sure if this is just the original kennels or maybe just adds to your kennel. It looks like it adds because it looks like it's all part of the picture there. And we can already see the expansion stuff here. It shows the European dogs and the famous dogs. We'll pop those open, take a closer look at those. We'll take a look, closer look at all these cards. A lot of cards. All right, let's take a look at some of the stuff in here. All right, I'm not sure if that's how these go down in the trays, but you can see here the different types. We got the balls, looks like doggy biscuits, some wooden sticks, and probably some squeak toys. Except there's only four resources. I'm sure they're supposed, I just dispersed them amongst the trays, but we'll see if other stuff's supposed to go down in there. But we got our little lids for covering up those. What else we got down in here? These just look like more of 
the things for each color and they look the same just and I'm assuming these are just where your dog walker is on the path to show and then we got some baggies oh nope nope I almost threw that baggie away or off to the side with my other baggies but that's actually we're going to need those for the dials so we'll just put that back there let's take a closer look at these cards all right, right off the bat, we have these smaller cards. They say forecast on them. I'm assuming this is like, well, I was thinking weather, but because of forecasting the weather, but maybe it's forecasting the round is what they're saying. So I'm assuming random events or something that happens on each turn. Then we got breed experts here. I'm assuming these are the type of dogs you're trying to get into your kennel. And it's just letting you know the percentage of the dogs there. Then we have a ton of these cards. We'll see if they got different backs or not. Those all look the same. Oh, I see different backs on these. And then those are the same. Yep. All right. So these say location bonus on them. And you can see they've got different spots with different little symbols on them. So I'm assuming putting extra stuff on maybe. Hmm. Then we have looks like objectives. And I notice they got numbers on the bottom to show you the cards. Just starting noticing more and more games now. And then it shows solo ratings. That was legendary. This one's expert. This one's intermediate. So this one's probably the beginner or novice. Uh, I'm assuming four of them, so probably player aid. There's four of those. Three, four, four of these. So I'm assuming another player aid, just showing the game rounds and the phases breakdown. And this let you know, first edition dog park. It says it has... Four limited edition alternate art dog cards. Then you know the first edition and whatnot and what's in there. All right. And then this, this is a monstrous deck you can see here. So looks like about, yeah, about 200 cards. And you can just see. We got the toy dogs there. So it's got to get well mixed up. Because it looks like it's all still in their batch here. And we got the gun dogs. And I normally go through all the cards. But when they're just things, I just usually flip through. But we're going to go through all these so you can see all the different dogs. I'll wait you can see if the dog you like is mixed in there. All right, I'm gonna put those down. We got the hounds here, Bavarian Mountain Hound. Pastoral dogs. All right. And then we have the terriers.
Go through these a little bit faster now. Not the deck's much smaller. The utility dogs. Oh. So throw the bulldog down. Then we have the working dogs. And I'm assuming, because it shows these four is different, these are the first edition dogs. Because I noticed, yep, these are the ones that say if you have the first edition of the game. And now we'll go through the expansion things, which are for the collector's edition, the European dogs. Shows you an ability index. And then we're going to have the dogs. And they're probably just going to be put into their batches here. Because there's the hounds, the pastorals, the terriers, the toy, and the utilities, oh, and the working. And then we have the famous Dawes expansion. Cool. All right. Well, I like dogs. And this gave me a very much a wingspan-like vibe. So we'll try to get this in table and see what it's like. Other than that, thank you for watching. And have a great day.